This is Naina Curley of Wamda Media. I'm here with Amal Al Khosaibi, the co-founder of Kay's Cafe, a cafe based in Muscat, Oman. Amal, how are you? Hi, nice to meet you, Naila. <laughs> nice to meet you. Tell me about Kay's Cafe. How did you get inspired to start a cafe in Muscat? Yeah, actually, the Kay's Cafe idea um, went back to two years ago. Uh, we had uh, my sister is the mind behind the idea itself. Uh, she started her catering from home. Uh, we were just supporting. And then we, th we sat as four sisters. We are actually four sisters owning the cafe currently. Uh, we sat and we thought, how can we commercialize this? I mean, how can we commercialize a, cat a home catering business to a cafe and, and take, it, I mean, take it further level? And uh, we thought of, uh, we started planning, and that's a year ago. We're starting the whole plan for the cafe. Was it difficult to take it commercial? It is, actually, especially if you don't have any idea about doing any business. Uh, we just thought, okay, what do we need? I'm an HR person by background, and I, 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 I would know, of course, about project planning and, and some, some of uh, the needs uh, and the supply needed. So we sat and we thought, okay, we need someone to, to hire to just give us a feasibility study. And we did go to uh, one of the... Uh, experts and we got a feasibility study. Uh, then we saw what is needed in terms of financial supply, other supplies, other support and we went from there. How did you first fund the business? Was it self-funded? Did you find support? It is self-funded. Um, support came actually from the relatives so we do have some relatives uh, uh, lend us some money so we, we, did, we did use some help from around. Yeah. And so you started it with your sisters. Um, was your family very supportive? Very, very. Family, friends, all around. I mean, I, I really, I really appreciate the support we got. Um, and, co and being four sisters, it's really helpful because everyone is specialized in, every, in, in a different area. And that, when putting to the efforts together, helped in starting the business. Is it ever tricky to be related to your co-founders? I mean, you can't really fire them if something goes wrong. Exactly. And we always got along. That's the good thing. I mean, as a sisters, we always get along. We are different, but we did get along. And we did put rules in the beginning. I mean, anything happened, we have to discuss it. We have to agree to it. And the majority wins. So, <laughs> so it is tricky, but we are getting there. <laughs> it's democratic. Yes. Um, so do you have plans to expand outside of how many shops do you have now and, and when will you expand? We are really new, so we, uh, we started in July this year. Um, the expansion, of course we have our vision, mission, mission and where we want to go in, within at least a one year. Uh, but currently we are settling in, we're trying to, to organize our supplies, trying to organize our internal uh, paperwork. And then the plan is to expand internally in Oman. Um, focused on certain corporates, so that's that's the, the plan. Yeah, I see. And has it been easy to get customers thus far? What's special about the cafe that brings customers in? The atmosphere, I would say. <laughs> um, it's uh, it's a little French in Oman, <laughs> France in Oman, which means it's very cozy, very uh, homemade uh, like food, and. Um, People like it because people are uh, people have changed in Oman. More younger generation like to be outside a lot, like to work out. Uh, so yeah, we are getting our customers, and most of them females, surprisingly. <laughs> nice. And um, just in, in terms of being an entrepreneur in Oman, have you found support in a broader community? What is that like? Um, what do you hope would change and evolve in the future? It is, uh, at the beginning it was difficult, uh, but the support is um, increasingly getting better in Oman. Especially that more and more young people are opening, Omani young people are opening. And with the directive of His Majesty uh, that focus on the young and focus on the uh, private sector, uh, a lot of support from the ministries came as well. So that, that was, this was good. Yeah. Do you go to any meetups or groups? And um, and if you do, you know, what's the ratio of men to women? Do you guys stand out, or are you are there a lot of people doing what you're doing? Um, yes, we do stand out. It's a lot of, uh, I mean, as ladies running a coffee shop, it's not really many in Oman. Um, most of them started with franchise, but then starting a whole idea by yourself is different. 
Um, meet, yes, we do attend a lot of meetings, and as, as I said, the ministry actually give us contacts, and we do get invited a lot uh, to just learn and sometimes share our story. So that's that's a good a good mix up. Being here actually is one of the contacts that we got. So fantastic. Well, good luck with the cafe. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.